So hi and welcome to another Slasher review and today I'm reviewing the Fun House. So the Fun House from 1981 from the US, directed by Tobe Hooper and written by Lawrence J. Block. Starring Elizabeth Berridge, Sean Carson, Cooper Huckabee, uh, Largo Woodruff, Miles Sh Chapin and Wayne Dova among a lot of people. So uh, Hooper's The Fun House is about four teenagers, one of them Amy, is going on a date uh, or a double date and they're going to a you know, car carnival, to a local carnival and they have some fun, sneak in to watch stuff but then they decide that they will spend the night there so they will sneak in and not come out and that turns out to be a very terrible idea so yeah, like I, I've seen this film a lot of times now, and here's my edition of it, the Arrow edition. Uh, the cover is so cool. Here's the other one. Very cool. I think th this was also one of the first Arrow editions I got, besides Battle Royale. Very happy with it. Uh, but the film, I think the, the story is quite fun and the setting is fun on the carnival because they can show a lot of different and fun and weird and creepy characters, uh, which they do. Uh, and the atmosphere is quite creepy in some scenes and also they have a very weird guy working there uh, and he's kind of like a, a monster and I think his look is very cool. Uh, so whenever he's in frame, like I can't stop looking at him. His uh, that mask or that or whatever it it was made with such great detail, and it was very cool. And if you've seen it, you of course know what I'm talking about. And there is a scene uh, where one of the girls she's stuck in a I don't know what to call it shaft or something, uh, which has like behind her is like. She can't get out, so that's why she's stuck there. Uh, and it's a metal thing, or metal floors, metal, whatever you can crawl in. And then you see this monster coming, comes, and I, I find that scene is quite creepy. It's the atmosphere is perfect, uh, just the, the f cinematography, the framing is very good on the way that this monster is coming closer and closer. I think that scene is very well made. Uh, and I do en enjoy this film a lot. Uh, and this film does pay such a homage to the opening of Halloween. You know where the brother goes with the mask on and going around the house looking for his sister. Yeah, uh, this is both an homage to Halloween and to Psycho. Because in the opening, uh, Amy's taking a shower, and her little, little brother uh, is doing the Michael Myers thing with the mask and scares her in the shower with ee, ee. But it's of course fake. But it's fun to see that they uh, do an homage to these amazing films. And I do like the characters also in this film. Uh, I don't really find them annoying at all. Uh, and I do like. Uh, some of the kills, I think they could have been even more gory, or more kills, prefer preferably. But uh, overall, the story is good. Um, the details with the marsh things are great. The monster is great. The setting is very cool, uh, a bit different. So I do think that the Fun House uh, is one of the slashers that stands out in the golden era. So I'm very happy to have it in my collection. So I will give it an 8 out of 10. And what do you think about this film? Uh, let me know if you've seen it. If you haven't seen it, do you plan on watching it? So thank you for watching this review. See you next time. Bye.